Yo people, welcome back. Yeah, it's been a long time, I know. Right, my aim is to look for potential altcoin gems, especially in the Arbitrum chain, because we know Arbitrum's just released and it's the new hype is at least holding 50% of the Ethereum chip network. That's how that's how good and strong it is itself. I know the price has a lot of fluctuation, that's normal, but anyway, we leave that to another video. Right, like guys, we're going to look at Oreo Swap. The reason why I think Oreo Swap has big, big potential because it's a DEX. I know from my previous bull market, bear market to bull market, that a lot of DEXs always performed because Arbitrum is going to perform. We all know Arbitrum is going to perform. Because Arbitrum is going to perform, its coins will perform with it. And especially coins like Audio Swap, where it's a DEX and you can swap coins, trade, and so on. So I'll go and show you the, the first, I'll show you the market cap. The market cap is very, very small. This coin is very, very high risk at the same time. I'm not saying it's, it's going to guarantee move, but most likely, potential is that. In my eyes, I see it do a great gain of at least half a million market cap. So that's going to bring us to around probably about $20, so, somewhere near there anyway. So the volume is, uh, to be honest, this, this volume is not um, correct. That's, that, that's wrong. That. But the market cap is 451 million, which is hardly nothing. It's nothing at all whatsoever. Max supply is 90 million. Total supply is not, is, we've not put it down. Uh, circulating supply is uh, 99. So, circulating supply is 1 million, which is, yes, it's not, it's not much circulating, is it? I know the supply is not much circulating, and most likely, the more the market cap trends higher, the more they'll put more supply um into circulation but if if i get in now at this price or just dc just put 50 quid or 100 dollars in it that 100 dollars or 50 dollars can easily 500x for me because 500x a thousand x could do even more why because it's a low cap gem this is the reason why i'm going to look more into low cap gems like this and obviously the ecosystem is Arbitrum ecosystem. Uh, they have the white paper. Um, I'm not going to go into any of the community or anything like that. But let's go into the chart. Yeah, there's the chart. And it's a fairly new coin. It started at 25 cents. So which means that it didn't pump and then dump. And it's just been trending sideways for quite a long time. And then we had a big uh, pump to about one, one, 198. And obviously now we just accumulation and then we broke our accumulation and hopefully we should go be going for the next next phase but the reason why we have gone down today is most likely because of btc because the all kinds are taking a bit of a bleeding because the dominance comes into concept well um this coin i've got um really high hopes of it to be honest really high hopes i'll i'll show you a comparison of another coin on another chain um, we're just going to have a look at the website. Where the hell is the website? I did it, have a. Oh, there it is. <laughs> I'm not doing a video for a long time, so I'm a bit rusty at the moment, but yeah. Right, this is the website. Now, this looks very nice to me. I actually prefer this layout and look more than Pancake Swap. I know Pancake Swap is a big dex and blah blah blah. It's from the biggest chains, but this is this is so easy to use. Just arbitrum that that's the coin price right now. You can connect your wallet from there. You can swap you can swap different different assets. So meaning that most most of the arbitrum assets will be on here. You got um, yield farming as well, which is a very good thing. You got milk pool, 
you got a vault beta as well that's for your like new projects and so on uh, you got your nfts on it as well you can mint nfts they actually have nfts on it as well so these are the different different nfts what they've got i'm not a big fan of nfts at the moment to be honest um not my thing but yeah there is money to be made and they've got lottery pools just like every other name of every other DeFi has lottery pool i don't know what's what's with the new trend but yeah last time i seen it it was 500 um dollars now it's 380 which means that prize has been won uh, you you can, you can refer a friend and obviously gain some um, benefits. And yeah, uh, they have these um, overflow sales as well, where you can um, buy before. But this uh, Flocky Yoga has has finished now. And this is all the instructions and the audits and so on. But um, the reason why. I think that this is going to do very good potential is I'll show you right now what the reason is right it was because of bakery swap because bakery swap is a part of Binance chain yeah which obviously is a massive massive chain Right, bakery swap. I've already got. Uh, they've got Dodo swap. They've got Pancake swap. They've got. Um, they've got another one, but they've got quite a few. But this bakery truck, but this bakery swap was one of its very, very low cap gems. I still remember this coin. Its market cap was about, I think, nine hundred million, something like eight hundred million. And I'll show you now on the data if I go to the market caps. There's market cap. Right. So if you look over here. Right, so the market cap was around, let's get a good figure. Right, so the lowest low was about $600,000. So from a $600,000, it went all the way at its high to a $1.36 billion market cap. Even though it's a $1.63 billion market cap, it was still trending at the top 200s. So which means that this could do it why can't audio swap do it i really really do think that audio swap has very very big potential to be gaining to at least a half million market cap which is a very very good gain that's the reason why i've invested in this coin i'm going to be looking at more and more arbitrum projects because, especially because arbitrum is the new hype i know it's that i'm going to try finding more new hypes for the next forum because Hypes, hype is the biggest thing when it comes to crypto. I know narrative plays one factor, but when it comes to hype, hype always kills over narrative. Obviously, not not for a long term, but for the short term it does. But the price action is more more intense. I know it's more risky, but the price action is more intense because obviously we want we want that risk to reward ratio. Right, guys, this was my video on Oreo swap. I hope you like. I hope you like it. But um, yeah, you just got to hang around. You know, stick with me for a bit. I'm not doing any videos for a very long time, so I'm a bit rusty. So um, yeah, my next videos um gonna be on Arbitrum as well. Thanks a lot. See you later.